Hello everyone and I welcome all of you to online study for you a complete placement solution. Friends, today we have a special guest with us and she is also our student. So her name is Neveda and recently she cracked Accenture and she got her joining after two months. She joined Accenture and now from last six months she is working in Accenture. So today uh, we will ask her the complete process or the time she took uh, from the written test till the joining and also we will discuss what about the other 2022 2023 candidates those who are waiting for interview results those who are waiting for joining so we are going to discuss here so i request all of you to watch the video till the end now uh, so welcome to our platform Neveda. yeah thank you thank you for having me okay so before we get into discussion so we wanted to know a bit about yourself like what is your batch and from where did you do your engineering branch and all those things so yeah yeah please yeah, hi everyone. I'm Niveta and I'm currently working in Accenture as Package Dev Development Associate under Testing Stream. And I've passed out on 2023 and I've been working in Accenture for the past six months. I got onboarded on July and I'm working in Chennai branch. So, yeah. So, you you uh, you are basically from Chennai only, right? You're native. Um, no, no. I'm from Coimbatore. I've completed my college in Sri Krishna Aditya College in Coimbatore. Now for Accenture, I came to Chennai, yeah. Okay, because I you know like on like most of uh, the students on our channel are from South India. Okay. So Sandra, Bangalore, Chennai. Mm -hmm. So you can say like 80 to 90 percent of the students we have from South India mm -hmm. and they are really nice. So, yeah. okay. So the next question is like uh, how much time it took for you in the complete process? I mean, in written test, after mm -hmm. written, you know, the interviews and then interview results and then the joining and then the documentation process right so i could also see now they are sending some kind of uh, you know mails uh, yeah. or many students uh, you know got joining also so mm -hmm. please tell me about your process first and then we will talk about uh, yeah like the other students. yeah about my process uh first i've completed the three rounds of interview which we have like the mandatory three rounds of interview like after the final interview it took me like one month to get the interview results so uh, you mean uh, three rounds of uh, like written, uh, right? Cognitive, yeah, the cognitive assessment, English verbal test, and then mm -hmm. final interview. So these three rounds happened in, in one month. Mm -hmm. And after that, uh, after final interview, my results came like after a month. So mm -hmm. after a month, I received the results. And after receiving results, I received the result in mail. And uh, after that, uh, it took me like around two months to join in Accenture. Yeah. Okay. So after two months, you got the onboarding. Yeah. So uh, what I can understood from here, like this uh, first cognitive and then the communication assessment and then the interview. So all three yeah. uh, together, it took almost one month. Uh, and then um, the result took another one month. Yes. And then after two months, you got the joining, right? But yeah. here students, you know, uh, like they are losing their patience. So that's what I always tell them. So you have to wait, right? Because yeah. things will ha be happening in the batches. Mm -hmm. And also you can keep applying for other examination, mm -hmm. right? Okay. Yeah. So uh, like what are the process, you know, after the interview, like how many mails and all you get before mm -hmm. you're joining? So that also can you please provide yeah. some so after interview, even I lost my patience at one point, actually. It took me like one month, right? I was eagerly waiting for the results. So after, uh, till the results, I haven't got any other mail from Accenture. It's only the result mail, which I got after a month. So after the results mail, like um, I got uh, LOI, which is like letter of, in, um, sorry. Yeah, letter yeah. of intent. Yeah, letter of intention. So I have to accept that like within five days, it seems. Like after accepting that, I've received a few mails from Accenture regarding document submission. Uh, document verification is another big process which we have in Accenture. So it took me like uh, one month to complete the entire process actually. So after documentation process, I've received the offer letter mail and then uh, the primers mail, which I have to study the modules which it has so i got that mail and then my date of joining mail so these are the process comes and after that okay I've been the so uh, if the students are interested uh, mm -hmm. please comment and i mean the students will comment and then uh, i think i'll be calling you once more uh, for yeah. the complete process in detail like this primers and all those things because yeah, yeah. see we deal with uh, only like aptitude reasoning mm -hmm. i mean cognitive uh, um, verbal and then interview yeah. after that uh, and definitely the inside the process mm -hmm. uh, maybe so you will be uh, giving more information yeah, yeah. Sure, okay <clears throat> so one more how did you prepare for accenture i mean uh... um 
the yeah. interview, the first cognitive that one you're asking about. Yeah. Yes, I mean all all three rounds. Yeah, for the three rounds, uh, particularly for the first round, cognitive assessment is entirely on uh, aptitude and logical reasoning. So basically, I've referred to a few YouTube channels, like, like including online study for your placement. I've referred uh, YouTube channels and YouTube videos, and I've gone through entire video like what are the concepts, I've understood the concepts, and about, uh, we need few uh, basic, like the common logical reasoning knowledge as well and i've practiced the previous year questions also like the interview questions which we have in certain websites right and also i have referred to youtube videos that's how i prepared great yeah. okay and do you have any idea about the 2024 batch graduates on campus uh, and off campus what exactly is happening yeah actually uh 2024 my juniors my mm -hmm. college juniors they have attended the accenture interview it seems and few of them got selection mail as well and uh, about off-campus, Accenture should hire. Actually, the market is really good. So uh, students can also prepare for off-campus. They are hiring. So yeah, I don't know the exact month when they'll get the results and onboarding date and all. But yeah, that is market. Can... Okay, yeah. So uh, at least in 2024, we are seeing like uh, certain hirings are happening. And Accenture yeah. is one of the company which is giving onboarding. So even if it is little delay, but people are getting onboarded. Okay, so uh, uh, now in Accenture, mm -hmm. so are there any phrases uh, like 2022, 2023, so they are joining or they have joined in the last two, three months. So do you have any idea about that? Um, I don't have uh, like the exact idea about it, but um, I uh, the onboarding is happening if, if, even though in our campus also. Mm -hmm. uh like every other month like every two months new people are coming like onboarding is happening but i don't know like which exact month they'll uh, join i i can't predict that though mm -hmm. but uh yeah there are uh, onboardings happening in yes yes because we see like you know uh because we make the videos so we come to mm -hmm. know okay so the onboarding is happening but uh definitely it is happening so does it happen in phases or how it how it actually works so i mean uh, they will be taking okay certain number of students and then they will train them or how, mm -hmm. how exactly that happens? Yeah, actually, um, from uh, from my understanding, like uh, first they have onboarded us and then uh, they have separated us into different streams and they gave, started to give training to us. In the middle of our training, new batch came up and they started to uh, divide them into separate streams and they start like uh, in the middle of every uh, onboard, newly onboarded batch, batch, mm -hmm. uh, batch right? So yes, they yes. are onboarding a new batch again, I guess. So... Okay, That's okay. So well. this this generally happens in the batches. See, even yeah. these things like you know when we say when we communicate to you and when we say they shouldn't, they, mm -hmm. I mean, I mean they will not have that kind of confidence. So that's the reason I called you. Yeah. So that see because when you are in training and if some new people are coming, you will have the more idea because see mm -hmm. we are sitting here and we just listen and then we tell the students. Okay, so uh, now the students are you know uh, like. There are many students who are losing the patience like at a certain point of time you lost your patience mm -hmm. so mm -hmm. like what is uh, the masses your message to them so uh, they yeah. should wait and try for other exams or how how this it proceed yeah that that's what like patience is really important especially like uh if you if you want to build a career in it field and if you gave your interview uh just forget about the thing the results and all have confidence in yourself and wait for the results and uh, at the at the time you have to you have to be patient for sure and hope for the good and uh, also you can prepare for another like some other companies also and um, yeah patience is really important and uh, hope for the best that's what i do okay uh, one more question like uh, mm -hmm. do you know anyone in your batch like someone received rejection mail from accenture or see that is very sure like whoever would have attempted everyone will not get selected yeah so does accenture send a rejection mail or uh, there is some kind of like you know things or they don't send at all and how they will come to know that they have got selected or not so maybe your yeah. friend or someone yeah yeah in my batch uh only five or six of us got selected um a few of them got rejection mail as well they are like better luck next time we'll uh, be looking for for you like next time like that they got but few of them haven't received any information. Like they haven't received selection mail or rejection mail. They haven't received anything. There are like two extremes. Like even though in our batches, there are many people. Um, only if you receive the selection mail, you're selected. Uh, in case if you haven't received any mail, uh, it seems you're rejected only. Like that's how it went. 
Uh, actually, uh, this is with every company, not only yeah. with Accenture. So even with the many companies, they will do the same thing. They will, I don't know, like they send it or not, or that mail they will send or it won't reach to a students. But mm-hmm. yeah, uh, definitely, if there if there is selection mail, they will be getting uh, even in the two. Uh, so there is something something happens in the tool and all. I don't know. So I just wanted to understand from yeah. you. So actually, suppose it's quite confusing for students. Actually, they they will be eagerly waiting. At least they want a. Uh, confirmation right from the company either they are rejected or selected yeah okay is... okay uh, just on scenario like uh, suppose you got selected and mm-hmm. they sent you mail or it didn't reach to you or went into a spam or something so do you have any kind of uh, tool for accenture like tcs we have a tool where we go and see like okay what is the uh, things are happening so something mm-hmm. is there for accenture also so when you basically apply for accenture then mm-hmm. there is something uh, yeah, some I status and all comes or uh, how it is um no like till we get resist, uh, till we get the uh, documentation verification process right till then only mail email is the only communication we have with accenture actually it's quite difficult uh, to be honest but only mails are the uh, the mediator we have okay then uh, then students will have to check their spam folder and all yeah uh, exactly yeah so they will be keep checking it okay yeah, anyway please. see being a student uh, what else we have so we have to prepare we have to apply for the jobs we have to keep mm-hmm. checking uh, mail yeah. on daily basis yeah. so this being a student that's what we have so uh, thanks nevada maybe like you know i have extracted only uh, uh, mm-hmm. like a part of 30% information from you so you still have 70% information and if students are in for, uh, interested uh, i'll definitely like we will have a live session okay. or uh, maybe uh, you know uh, the next session and also i forgot to tell uh, you guys so she has youtube channel and there also you can mm-hmm. find or uh, some of the information so that link yeah. will be the in the video description so you can check it out and also on instagram uh, uh, you know uh, we will be tagging her in one of the reels so there also you can reach out to her and anyway we are always there as usual so thanks a lot uh, nivedha for yeah, coming to our you, platform Mary. and guiding the students yeah thank you sir thank you